hello on this wednesday, october thirty first, two thousand and seven. i'm kristen volk with a upi top news headline democratic presidential contender dennis kucinich is raising eyebrows after questioning president bush's mental health kucinich made the comment yesterday to the philadelphia inquirer in reference to the president's recent remarks on iran bush suggested world war three could happen if the country obtained nuclear capabilities the ohio congressman said there's something wrong as bush doesn't seem to understand his words have real impact the Democratic presidential candidate later said he didn't consider his comment inappropriate. House Speaker Nancy Pelosi is asking for the resignation of the acting chairwoman of the Consumer Product Safety Commission. Pelosi is accusing Nancy Nord of ignoring a growing problem with hazardous substances and toys and opposing a bill that would give the safety agency more money and authority. Nord reportedly says the legislation for her agency could have unintended consequences of hampering rather than furthering the safety of toys. NASA has found a second tear in the International Space Station's solar panels. The discovery could delay future missions and make it more difficult to finish building the orbiting outpost before the space shuttles must be retired in 2010. Astronauts will spend today thoroughly inspecting the problem on the mission's fourth spacewalk. Until at least one of the tears is fixed, the station won't be able to generate enough power to support new equipment. A child playing with matches is to blame for the buckweed fire that destroyed more than 38,000 acres in North Los Angeles County. That's according to California police. The boy, whose name and age weren't released, says it was an accident. He's been turned over to his parents, and the case will be presented to the district attorney's office. The fire was among more than a dozen major wildfires that killed 14 people and destroyed nearly 2,200 homes. Thanks for watching today's news headline. Go to UPI.com to check out our special report called Outgrowing Foster Care. Have a great day.